just wait and see if anybody comes. Hello? So, good morning everyone and welcome to story time. I'm so excited to do this story time with you guys today and we are going to be doing a farm animal story time. So, if you guys are ready, we'll go ahead and get started with our hello song. And it goes like this. We clap and sing hello. We clap and sing hello. With our friends at story time. We clap and sing hello. We wave and sing hello. We wave and sing hello. With our friends at story time. We wave and sing hello. We stomp and sing hello. We stomp and sing hello. With our friends at story time. We stomp and sing hello. Awesome. Good job. Awesome. And our first book today is called Click Clack Moo. Cows That Type. And we are reading this with permission of Simon & Schuster Publishing. Farmer Brown has a problem. His cows like to type. All day long, he hears. Click, clack, moo. Click, clack, moo. Clickety, clack, moo. That is silly. Cows don't know how to type. At first, he couldn't believe his ears. Cows that type, impossible. Click, clack, moo. Click, clack, moo. Clickety-clack, moo. Then he couldn't believe his eyes. Dear Farmer Brown, the barn is very cold at night. We'd like some electric blankets. Sincerely, the cows. It was bad enough the cows had found the old typewriter in the barn. Now they wanted electric blankets. No way, said Farmer Brown. No electric blankets. So the cows went on strike. They left a note on the barn door. Sorry, we're closed. No milk today. No milk today, cried Farmer Brown in the background. He heard the cows busy at work. Click, clack, moo. Click, clack, moo. Clickety, clack, moo. The next day, he got another note. Dear Farmer Brown, the hens are cold too. They would like electric blankets. Sincerely, the cows. The cows were growing impatient with the farmer. They left a new note on the barn door. Closed. No milk, no eggs. No eggs, cried Farmer Brown. In the background, he heard them. Click, clack, moo. Click, clack, moo. Clickety, clack, moo. Those cows are so silly. Cows that type, hens on strike, who ever heard of such a thing? How can I run a farm with no milk and no eggs? Farmer Brown was furious. Farmer Brown got out his own typewriter. Dear cows and hens, there will be no electric blankets. You are cows and hens. I demand milk and eggs. Sincerely, Farmer Brown. Duck was a neutral party, so he brought the ultimatum to the cows. There's the duck. He's taking the letter over to the cows. The, cow the cows held an emergency meeting. All the animals gathered around the barn to snoop. 
but none of them could understand Moo. All night long, Farmer Brown waited for an answer. Duck knocked on the door early the next morning. He handed Farmer Brown a note. Dear Farmer Brown, we will exchange our typewriter for electric blankets. Leave them outside the barn door, and we will send Duck over with the typewriter. Sincerely, the cows. They're going to trade their typewriter for some blankets. Farmer Brown decided this was a good deal. He left the blankets next to the barn door and waited for the duck with the typewriter. The next morning, he got a note. Dear Farmer Brown, the pond is quite boring. We'd like a diving board. Sincerely, the ducks. Click, clack, quack. Click, clack, quack. Clickety, clack. Whack. Do you think that Farmer Brown will give them a diving board? There they go. They got their diving board. <laughs> Good. Awesome. And that's the end of that story. So now we are going to do a rhyme. And I think a lot of you guys know this rhyme. This is Old McDonald. And I have Old McDonald in his barn. So we are going to add some animals. I have five animals today. Our first animal is a cow. Do you guys know what sound cows make? Moo, moo, good. So, here's our cow. Oh, McDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O. And on his farm he had a cow, E-I-E-I-O. With a moo moo here and a moo moo there. Here a moo, there a moo, everywhere a moo moo. Old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O. Awesome. Our next animal on the farm, it's a dog. Do you guys know what sound dogs make? Bark, bark, bark. Yeah. So we're going to add the dog to the farm. And Old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O. And on that farm he had a dog, E-I-E-I-O. With a bark bark here and a bark bark there. Here a bark, there a bark, everywhere a bark bark. Old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O. Now. Next animal for the farm, it's a horse. Do you guys know what sound horses make? Nay, nay. So we will put our horse on the farm. And Old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O. And on his farm he had a horse, E-I-E-I-O. With the nay, nay here and the nay, nay there. Here an A, there an A, everywhere an A, A. Old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O. Yay! We have two more animals on the farm. The next one is a cat. Do you guys know what cats say? Meow, meow. Good. So put the cat right here. Old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O, and on that farm he had a cat, E-I-E-I-O, with a meow meow here and a meow meow there, here a meow, there a meow, everywhere a meow meow, Old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O. We have one more left. What do you guys think our last animal will be? It's a pig. It's a pig. Do you guys know what noise pigs make? Oink, oink, oink. So we'll put the pig up here. Old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O. And on that farm he had a pig, E-I-E-I-O. 
with the oink oink here and a oink oink there. Here a oink, there a oink, everywhere a oink oink. Old MacDonald had a farm. E-I-E-I-O. Good job, everyone. Awesome. We got all five animals on our farm. Awesome. And we have another book. This book is called Chicks Run Wild. We are reading this with permission of Simon & Schuster Publishing. Okay. Every night up in their beds, pillows fluffed up by their heads. Chicks are tucked beneath the sheets. Go to sleep now, Mama tweets. Mama kisses each dear child, but when she leaves, those chicks run wild. First they wiggle and they jump, then they giggle and they thump, playing swing in their pajamas when they hear their tired mama. Oh no, I don't think Mama is going to be very happy with them. All at once, the noisy riot disappears, and soon they're quiet. Mama peeks inside and sees baby chicks all catching Z's. But she catches feathers moving. Mama glowers, disapproving. Then she sighs, please close your eyes. And she says her last goodbyes. One more kiss for each dear child, but when she leaves. Those chicks run wild. They are not listening to their mama. They count one, two, three, and four, then do cartwheels on the floor. When they somersault and leap, someone sees they're not asleep. Oh no! Mama roars, you're all in trouble, back in bed now, on the double. Wings on her hips, she warns those chicks, no more games and no more tricks. One quick peck for each sweet child. She slams the door. What do you think's going to happen? Those chicks run wild. They begin a pillow fight in the middle of the night as the feathers fill the air. They see Mama standing there. Oh no. Baby chicks, yells tired Mama. Look at all this chicken drama. I would like an explanation. Where is Mama's invitation? Mama wants to have fun too. Baffled chicks stare at each other. Should they dare invite their mother? Does she really want to play? Come and join us, they all say. Mama dances with each child. In the night, she's dancing with them. They all go wild. Look at Mama. In a squall of fluffy feathers, all the fowls sashay together. Mama shows them how to prance and how to do the chicken dance. When the chicks begin to yawn, Mama clucks, my dears come on. But the chicks fall to their knees, moaning, bedtime mama please. Now the chicks are sleepy.
Mama sees that they are weepy. Her sweet chicks are finally sleepy. So she puts away their things, holds her babies in their wings. They're all sleepy now. They got tired from dancing. Chicks get tucked into their beds, pillows fluff beneath their heads. Cuddling underneath their sheets, no more stirring, no more tweets. One last kiss for each dear child. She leaves the room. And mama goes wild. <laughs> the end. That was so much fun. Thank you guys for joining my story time today. And don't forget, we have a lot of online programs going on here at the library. So make sure to go to our website and our Facebook page for those. So, now we are going to sing our goodbye song, and it goes just like our hello song. It goes, we clap and sing goodbye, we clap and sing goodbye, with our friends at story time, we clap and sing goodbye, we wave and sing goodbye, we wave and sing goodbye, with our friends at story time, we wave and sing goodbye. We stomp and sing goodbye, we stomp and sing goodbye, with our friends at story time, we stomp and sing goodbye. Great job guys and thank you.